principally, uh, this COVID-19 impact is not like SARS about uh, uh, 17 years ago. And during the SARS period, I think Taiwan had a very good experience and the economic was just like a V-shape. But from now, we look at the, the impact of COVID-19, we can uh, 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 confirm it's not, it will not be a V-shape. Maybe some people talk about it will be like a Nike, will go up smoothly. But we think, uh, uh, I keep a doubt. I don't want to give a, a too positive thing like that. We got to be ready for that. Because this virus will be stay with us minimum for the next two years, OK? So the medical team had to advise us without the, 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 the vaccine uh, to be there. And, and before the vaccine can be mass production, plus uh, efficiency of the population, over 70% have been be taking the, the vaccine. And then the, the, we had to find a way to live with the virus together. That's the, the situation right now. So we believe that a lot of new normal will come up. That's what Thailand, we talk a lot. Uh, we got to educate people and don't think that our life will go back as whatever we we done in the 2019 or before that. So please, uh, uh, our advice is a lot of things going to change. So what's the new normal? First, on the health part, I believe that in the next uh, one and a half year to two year time, don't forget, you still, even though right now we are in our own place, but when you go out of the public area, put on your mask and you had to wear your mask and then you had to wash your hand often, you still had to keep your social distance. And then maybe some of the countries still had to find out how to do the track system. And then of course we have still had uh, avoiding being together in the coast area for more than two hours. So because the virus are, are deep in there. We can see that uh, 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 Thailand, we are in the aging society. So when uh, COVID-19 happened, we have certain people, uh, the elder people or whoever are not strong enough, uh, we have to have lost their life. And But with a more younger society, maybe they have better the, 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 the immune system to, to fight for that. But the most important thing, the, the, the COVID-19, the virus is around uh, our area. So, so that thing will not get away uh, that fast. So our estimate is uh, 1.5 uh, year to two year time at this minimum. So we have to be aware of that. So things happen on the business side, a lot of things that we cannot, we, we, we think that we cannot do in the past, right now we can do it. Example, uh, during the last uh, uh, four or five months, uh, our in Thailand, we asked people to work from home. No, uh, the people are changing life. You know, in the past, the traffic in Bangkok, you know that is very heavy. So in the last four months, uh, we are working uh, in the environment without traffic and without PN 2.5. So the real environment, uh, air the air pollution are getting much better too. And then you know that and our business way of, of discussion are changing. Uh, in the 2019, I think the all these kind of technology are there. Uh, we, we can do the video conference, but we don't do that much. And this day in the last four months, I have this kind of video conference every day, almost uh, uh, for eight hours, uh, uh, different conference and schedule coming up. So it's a new new life, right? And, and next step, uh, international traveling. I think a lot of people talking about different area for the bubble traveling and how can we travel without quantering and because for the business people to go to another place, you have to be quarantined for 14 days, is really just ask people not to travel. It. So I think a lot of new SOP of traveling is, is coming out there. So and what will be what be like that? And then we got to study together. So the current period of time, a lot of new things coming on our life. And we believe the digital life are getting much faster. Oh so, uh, in the more in the in the past recently, we talked about all the e-commerce and traditional retail business. Right now, I think that kind of balance will come out to see that uh, what to what and how should we do. And then, and then in our personal life to the, the business operation, even to the government op operation. And, and then later on, maybe I can share something that the, our prime minister just gave us a talk yesterday, right? Uh, things change. And, and then uh, in the past, I'm trying to push very hard for the Thai government to become e-government. So, you know, it, it's, it's very challenging for them to do that too. But things that from now on, this kind of thing, the speed will be go up much faster. Uh, my last uh, presentation, uh, before we go that, I will show you for, for three things because we are talking about uh, after COVID-19, what will be happen. So at the first part, we call the ADS trend. That's what uh, uh, things happen from, from three, uh, 3G to 4G to 5G. You know, 
Thailand, which have the all the beating of a license for 5G, as expensive as Taiwan. So you know that that's what happened. People in, for sure that go for that. So when we go to the 5G uh, era, that automation, digitalization, and uh, smart solution. I mean the A IoT for sure will be there. And the pandemic will just speed up all these kind of things happen. Okay, and that's why I see uh, the trend will be like this. Uh, use less people, use more automation. You need to become more digitalization to get all the big data. And then the real, uh, the world that uh, before the pandemic come, we're talking about how can we uh, uh, live with the machine and how can we work together with the machine with the era of the, the AI into our life. And this will make it come faster. And another part is whatever we just talked about in, in Thailand and we had to put down as a government policy. I think uh, everybody knows that we talk about Thailand 4.0 since the last four or five years. And we also, we have the EEC, the Eastern Economic uh, Corridor, the spatial economics that we are pushing up. At the same time right now, uh, we are pushing up the BCG economy. Whatever we see that uh, we believe that will be more bioeconomic. Uh, people are awareness more about healthy and better life. And plus uh, we are looking more on the circular economy because uh, we are not just taking things from the earth, but we to make sure that the, the, the circular economy can be well management and from now on and in the future. Of course, the pandemic come and a lot of uh, environment things where we also talk about the green economy. So principally, uh, we keep the some guideline for the, the future economic uh, uh, build it up for Thailand will be on the BCG economy. And that means that uh, we have, we are changing our uh, 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 business from the cost uh, thinking to the added value thinking. So